Hi, you guys. This is Shozy, and you are going to laugh. You, do you know what this is? You probably don't know what this is. Well, let me show you what's in the freezer here. <sighs> Sorry, it's black. Um, I made two other ones. This one and this one. I did these last night. And what I did in my refrigerator here, I have old, I have, well, it's not old, um, but it's, <laughs> it's cake. So he said, give your piggies a cake. I said, no, they're, they're vegetarians. They're going to eat cake. <laughs> um, and I'm not going to eat the recipe either. But um, it was birthday cake for this weekend. Anyway, coconut oil. I took a naturally refined organic coconut oil. I found this at, um, it's a neutral flavor. Um, which I think they're all neutral flavor. But anyway, um, I got that at Winco for like $10 for the big thing here. And I let it sit out to get soft for a few hours and then because I usually keep it in the fridge and then I spooned it into wax paper into these old because um, I always keep these if I have like dinners um, I keep them on hand for usually I paint in them but I had some that were clean and so I took three of them and I went ahead and spooned them into the bottom and I think a couple of them weren't quite I, I nuked them for like 30 seconds and just to make them totally, you know, liquid again. And then I put them in the freezer and this is what happened. So I had to actually take my hammer. I had to take my, um, my handy dandy hammer and put the wax paper over and smack it, take it out of the bowl, of course, and put it on, uh, on the counter and smack it a couple times. Um, because uh, Oscar the pig, pig's mom did this, except she used silicone little hearts, which were really wonderful, but she still has to break them because they're too big, the hearts are too big. So basically I took them, I made them into pieces. They absolutely love them. They're like, oh, we want more. <laughs> you should have heard Shag. He was actually crunching. It was hysterical. I, sh I wanted to, I should have gotten a video their very first time eating this. Um, but this is our treat. I okayed it with um, uh, better piggies to make sure that they could actually have these because what happens is is their skin gets really dry and instead of putting lotion which is creepy to me to put lotion all over them um, because I don't even lotion myself which is really bad but I take coconut oil um, pills um, bottled pills I'll show you those I'll insert a picture um, and I take this as well myself I take like one to two tablespoons um, I try to do it every night. I don't, I'm not really, usually really good at that for myself, but um, I do take the pill every single day without fail because I take it with a bunch of my other vitamins and things like that and supplements. Um, so anyway, so they have two more for tomorrow and I'm going to break up a bunch more and I'm going to put them um, in the refrigerator so they stay hard and I'll keep the other ones in the freezer or whatever, but I, I'll have them all ready, all their treats ready for the rest of the week. So they have to have one a day it's just like their vitamin and they can have these as a treat for night so they have something to look forward to and I call it their special treat so they they're gonna you know m um, mind uh, food association special treat so um, because they heard me feeding Tinky because she had to have she was getting into regular cat food and she can't eat regular cat food she has to have her iams because if, if she doesn't have her iams um, she has a hard time going potty she has probably something irritating in her bowel um, and she's not that old of a cat but she's always had this so anyway um, but I, I caught her going eating Nephi's food and Nephi ha is eating a mixture of food right now because we're using up all the old cat food and um, so it's been mixed with iams and the old stuff so anyway um, it's got some neutro in there too and something but it's got some cheap food too and I don't want her getting sick because she screams actually when she gets ready to go potty it's not it's not it's not a good thing so anyway um, that's that's my that's my alternative to putting them in silicone is just putting them on wax paper softening the coconut oil and putting it in the microwave for about 20 30 seconds till it gets soft um, putting it on the wax paper inside this so that you know it has a pan to hold it in and then putting them in the freezer and then cracking them with um, <laughs> something really hard because it's hard um, with the uh, um, you know, taking them out of there, of course, because you can't sit inside there. It already broke a little bit, wax paper. But um, cracking them with the... Uh, I'm just kidding.
give it a little bit of a nudge. We'll see how much that cracks. Probably nothing at all. No, no, I'm gonna have to crack it a little bit harder. All right, I'll do that later. But anyway, there you go. That's how that happens. And then putting them in a, another container to um, to stay nice and ready for them to eat um, in in the p.m. Um, every night. Okay, thanks so much for watching and take care. You can hear them in the other room. You could hear them a second ago, couldn't you? <laughs> they know what I'm doing. All right, bye-bye. <laughs>